Well, that's a really great question, Michael. And, uh, you know, it's really interesting. There are different regulatory requirements uh, between Europe and U.S. and other parts of the world. And actually, one of the different regulatory requirements is around headlamps. So there are certain things that we cannot do here in the U.S. that they can do in Europe. So that's one of the reasons you don't see more of the LED lights that you see in Europe than you see here in the U.S. And it really comes down to government regulation. But really great question. Uh, Kevin, that's a, a really great question. Uh, you've probably seen the RS that we have over in, uh, our Focus RS that we have over in Europe. Right now, we don't have uh, any plans to bring that over, but uh, you never know what may happen in the future. And uh, Nick, the question around uh, ST, really great question again. We're bringing that right here to the U.S., and that's going to be available in 2012, and uh, it's going to knock your socks off when not only you see it, but when you drive it. Uh, Tom, uh, on the question of will we do kind of all-wheel drive on, on the Focus, right now we don't have any plans to do that. Uh, Front-wheel drive, and it, a lot of it has to do with the driving dynamics of the vehicle. Uh, so we have no plans for that. And on the question around... Uh, what was the wheel drive and hybrid? Oh, on, on all-wheel drive and, and, and hybrid, uh, our plans for the Focus are pretty simple to come out, obviously, with the two-liter uh, gas engine that's coming out with the model that we're introducing early next year. We're gonna follow that up with a battery electric vehicle the end of 2011, and then we're gonna follow that on with our EcoBoost, our two-liter EcoBoost, which is direct injection and turbocharging in our Focus ST that's gonna come out in 2012.